All right, so question number five. So here we're asked, what is the specific heat of air? Just give me a second. All right, so specific heat of air, um, here the unit to answer is approximately one kilojoules per kilogram Kelvin. So you can see there's pretty complex units. It's essentially kilojoules per kilogram Kelvin. I'll explain to you why this is the case in a second. Here's the definition of what specific heat is. The specific heat of a material is defined as the quantity of heat required by a unit mass of the material to rise its temperature by one degree. To raise, sorry, this is it. So, so to raise its temperature by one degree. The specific heat of air depends on temperature. So temperature changes when the specific heat of air also will be changed. But the value is approximately this much. Okay, so uh, when this value, so often when we think about specific heat is represented by the constant C. So for all materials, they have a specific heat. So specific heat of air is just one. And it's, it's often used in this formula, Q is equal to M C delta T. So this is uh, C right here is specific heat. So I'll define all the variables. Q is the heat energy. M is mass of the material. C is specific heat. And finally, delta T is change. So delta, whenever you see a delta, it means change. And if this is in temperature. OK. So this is kind of the equation that you should know right here. And when we look at this equation, if we're given, let's say, a specific, you know, question. This is this is more of a general topic, but let's say we're given the heat energy, we're given the mass, and we're given the specific heat of, let's say, some material. Right here, we can calculate the change in temperature that would occur based on the heat energy added, the mass of the object, etc. We know how much temperature, the change in temperature, what will happen. So if it was at 25 degrees, how much it will increase or decrease based on the value calculated. So this is where specific heat is um, useful. Um, and usually specific heat is found for different materials in a table. And depending on the question, usually it's given or you have to look at a given table to find this value. So that's kind of a general overview of what specific heat is. And we've, all, we've kind of also given the value of the specific heat of Air. So, great work, correct answer. So, I'll mark this uh, question as correct and move on to question number six.